welcome Leos. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for uh, returning Leos. Your energies that we have, this is the business reading extend. Um, there is going to be an extended if you'd like to have. So this is the business reading for April, May and June. So I see um, um, 10 of spring, okay? Ask for help from others. All work and no play. Bring weights down by too many responsibility. This is a beautiful card to receive from Leo's. But this is all about, uh, there is a lot of burdens that you Leo's are carrying around your career work and uh, um you need to ask for help. So whatever is happening, whatever is transpiring, there is a lot of burdens that you are carrying. Then we have the Prince of Summer, gently sensitive and kind. Whatever is transpiring, I see some of you need to find that energy in order to deal with issue and situation. I see a new relationship or emotional experience. Um, invitation to social event, a compromise friend you can share your concern with. This person is coming in very gently person. So it could be on the work floor. It could be someone that is coming in to understand what you're going through and to help you with whatever the issues and situation is. So I see the energy of this fire energy that is coming up and this is transpiring where a lot of you Leos are going to be having some burdens with work, work issues, work situation, career, your finance, that sort of a thing. But anything to happen to work and business, I see a lot of you, but I see a young person is going to be coming in in order to help you to create stability in your world because it's all about finding stability because there is some of you Leos are carrying too much burden. There's a lot of work. There's a lot of stuff that has to be done. And some of you are definitely, definitely carrying too much issues and too much situations. So however, this is coming up and transpiring. Some of you, someone young is going to be coming in or someone who is a very easy, positive is going to be coming in in order to help you out of these burdens that you have been carrying. So some of you have passion um, in the spirit and some of you are going to be finding that emotional balance for other people around you. Some of you could be um, receiving this emotional balance on the work floor or people who are helping you to move you forward and push you forward in a positive direction. So all of this is happening and all of this is coming up. So um, you have the energy of fire, but also emotion where some of you could be creating um, positive emotions for other people. Okay. So let's see what is coming up. Uh, uh, we're calling up an Archangel Raphael, Angels of Abundance, Work Finance. I'm um, calling up all the universal angels and guides. The mother, father, God, Archangel Raphael. Angels of Abundance, it's coming up for work and um, for. Um, ooh, the Leo. Okay. So Leo's, I see you're dealing um, with a situation um, that is coming up or where you have uh, um, the energy of uh, some regrets. Okay. Um, where you're going back to the drawing board. You have the energy of some regrets where you're going back to the drawing board. This regrets has to do with... Uh, um, and um an Aquarius Gemini or Libra, it could be a doctor, um, you it could be um and it has to do with people in power. So some of you Leos, there could have been some in investigation in uh, in the workplace, uh, could have been auditing coming in your workplace, there could have been, and this is why some of you are carrying the burdens, but I see some issues that is happening. That is coming up with you and your boss. And if you have a business, I see some of you um, could be audited or investigated. I see the energy of uh, um, the five um, of uh, this energy is the energy of worries. A lot of you Leos are very worried, um, worried of issues and situation. 
but I see you're going to be communicating however way this is happening I see um, in the month of May you're going to be communicating I see um, some of you Leo is going to be using that power now in the month of June what we see here is happening and transpiring is that um, you're going to be moving um, forward moving away from a situation that has to do with people in power and whatever that was going on so this is the energy of the boss so as you can look at this um, layout and what you're seeing is that some of you um, could have been because of the burden some of you are having a lot of burdens at work I see some, some issues like auditing is coming in Leo's uh, you could be um, doing taxes and that sort of a thing but I see a situation where you Leo's are going to be audited okay however that is transpired I see some of you Leo's are worried worry about uh, the transition of situation that is coming up so you have the energy of the four of cups and some of you are dealing you have some conflicts um that you're trying to resolve and trying to um see what is the best way because but a lot of you leos in the workplace is having a lot of burdens and it's as if you're rethinking um how you could have made um other things change some of you are dealing with a young um pisces cancer or scorpion at the workplace um this is a young cancer i see you are very um you know upset very worried about this young cancer because it's as if whoever this person is they have created um it's as if um this person was given a task to do and they have made a mess of it and then you leaders have to um heal this and create this and i see that um, you're receiving information that you need to get this clear up. I see some of you are going to be standing your ground um, with a deceptive uh, situation where I see that uh, some of you are going to be using the sort of truth to communicate to this cancer person, whoever this cancer person is. I see that there are issues that was created on the work floor. I see a Virgo and a Cancer have created some issue on the work floor that you're trying to resolve or balance out. It could be because it looks as if that these people are creating issues on the work floor or issues around you in a business. I see that some of you, if you had either a Taurus or a Cancer person who were your personal advisor or secretary, I see that they created some uh, some of you this person could have got up and walk away and uh, leave you with a lot of stuff to resolve and then you take someone on a young um, water sign person um, a young cancer person that is uh, really um, you know they're very emotionally balanced but work wise they can't get um the, the 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 speed of the work flow is not going um the way but they're very emotional so um you're you're they're kind of trying to figure out in april what is the best uh, way of dealing with a situation because whoever the Taurus is uh, has just opt 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 and left you in a situation and i see you take on someone new who is very the Taurus was like very fiery um and um the you're going to be changing the taurus for um the cancer however this is coming up i see that this um this could be your boss and you're looking for the right person okay because i see that you're de either deciding to get rid of the taurus or you are going to be clearing up whatever the issue is now some of you um in the month of may is definitely going to be communicating clearly especially you bosses um where you bosses could be making some cut and you're going to be cutting um making some cuts so people are going to believe because i see in order for you to survive your business you have to make some cuts so i see that um it is something that you know you have already decided but um in order to carry it out i see your really because these are thoughts these are thoughts um you're moving forward you're using the energy some of you could be dealing 
all the tin seems to be coming up for you fire sign whatever is transpired I see the sense of auditing and especially in May, I see the sense of auditing that is coming up for you fire sign. However, it is, it, it is transpiring. Now, what we're seeing here is the energy of the emperor. Now, I see if you are a boss, definitely you have to make some huge decision in this period. However, it is coming up for you. However, it is going to be transpiring. In these three months, you have to make some huge decision in order um, to keep your business going, okay? So it is a sense where uh, some of you, once and you start and in order to create a, um, a positive flow to receive this new start, I see managers are going to decide to cut, to cut. But I see a lot of you business leos are going to be audited and... Uh, Whatever comes out that is audited, I don't see you have a new start. Um, because you businessmen, whatever is transpiring, why you're being audited, I see that this is going to cause you a lot of uh, worries and a lot of burdens. It's going to create a lot of worries and a lot of burdens. So um, whoever you are as a business person, it is the month of May, June is going to be extremely heavy for you because there are decisions that you have to make and these decisions that you have to make, it is vital, um, vital for you. However, this is transpiring. These decisions that you have to make is vital for you. So I see some of you um, have some regrets because you have to make decision in order that your business or in order that your position is safe in a company. So businessmen are definitely going to be having some problem with some auditing that is coming in. But um, for the rest of you, I see that information is going to be coming in some of you who are managers some of you are boss i see um in april you're receiving this message where you know you are trying to find the human part of how to deal with it and how to bring this message over some of you could be realizing that you have to step to your boss to let your boss know that um you know some drastic um changes has to come in this company so however it is transpiring in your world i see that um you know some of you have to make decision to communicate that some drastic change needs to happen in a company or um drastic change needs to be done in order for a certain um process to um move forward Businessmen are going to be really businessmen. You're going to be having replan. You have to replan. You have to make changes. You have to replan and make uh, changes. So, however, this is happening and transpiring, you businessmen have to really replan and make changes. Whatever changes is it that you have to make? I see it's not a very it's 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 a it's a very worrisome for you, but yet still you have to communicate this information in order to move forward so some of you definitely especially the business people um wants to move forward but in order to do this and in order to take that next step and move forward you have to be ready to um you know speak up and to let people know that hey um, your performance is not good. I need to um, get um, a more stable um, sort of a performance to come in and you can create better working environment. Okay. So I'm going to leave this here. Um, this reading is going to be continuing. Um, so if you're interested um, in order to get the extended of this reading to see exactly what is coming up for you, Leah's, what you can do is basically use the link below this video. It will take you to the on demand. You can um, receive the extended of this reading on on demand. I want to say thank you, Leos, for being here. And I hope to see you over on the other side. If not, I am wishing you a wonderful month. Now.